Hey guys, Paula here. I want to go ahead and talk to you about Harry's. Uh, this is their shave gel, their foaming shave gel, and then the post shave balm. So I just wanted to go ahead and do, um, kind of show you what the difference is between the two, because I think when um, young men are starting to shave, you have to kind of figure out what's going to work best for their skin type. And so I actually bought both of them because I do have twin boys and I knew that one kiddo would like one compared to the other. Uh, and so I just want to do a really quick demonstration of what the difference is between the shave gel and the foaming shave gel. So um, this is shave gel with aloe and uh, it actually comes out kind of like a gel. I mean, it looks very... Um, <laughs> very liquidy and so when you rub it together it actually will go ahead and lather itself up um, but it doesn't actually get very foamy it it will stay more of a paste um, and so they'll go ahead and they'll actually apply this to their face um, and if you apply a little bit of water to it it actually will go ahead and uh, make it move <laughs> make it slide a little bit easier um, as you can see, just like that. But it doesn't really foam up a whole lot, okay? So this is going to be the shave gel. So I'm going to rinse this off so that you can see what the foaming fa face gel looks like. The foaming shave gel, excuse me. Wipe my hands off here. Okay, so this is the foaming gel. And you can see my kids have definitely used this. These are theirs. They are um, 15, both of them. So again, comes out a little bit thicker. You can see the first one actually just kind of like slid all over my fingers and this one is not, it's actually a little bit thicker. And so I'm going to rub this together and you can see that it actually is a little bit more raised off my fingertips. This is actually more of a foam. So um, it actually looks kind of like that old school shave gel. So I just wanted to go ahead and show that to you. So if you have someone who's kind of wanting that old school foam, this is actually going to be it. Um, it comes out like a gel. So you saw it in the beginning and then it's actually going to go ahead and look like this. So go ahead and rub it on my hand here so you can see what it looks like. So it definitely has a lot more coverage um, and it smells really good. So I really love the way this smells. Um, I think it smells fantastic. So I'm going to rinse that off and then I'm going to go ahead and show you what the post shave balm looks like now the post shave balm is going to be um for your skin after you shave and this is to go ahead and make sure that you don't have um any of those little razor bumps um but it is a very small container this one's only 3.4 ounces uh it's a little bit bigger than the size of a quarter and it stands about four inches tall so this is what it looks like and it basically just looks kind of like a lotion and they're going to take it and they're going to rub it into their face. So go ahead and show you what that looks like. So you can see that it's going to be kind of like a watery substance. It's going to make it look like it's kind of shiny at first. But once they go ahead and they rub it in really good, my hands are kind of wet. Um, but once they go ahead and they rub it in pretty good, it actually will go ahead and seal those pores from shaving. So just wanted to go ahead and show you this really quick demonstration of kind of what everything looks like. Um, again, the scent of these are not very overpowering. Um, it's very light, uh, very soothing. It's, it's not like if I was to go up to my kids and give them a kiss on the cheek, I could definitely tell that they've shaved um, because you can smell it. So it's a very light scent. It's not overpowering. Um, and I know that for them, they've actually loved this brand compared to other brands. So hopefully this video will go ahead and kind of show you the difference between their shave gel versus their foaming shave gel. And then exactly what the post shave balm will go ahead and look like when they apply it to their face.